PreStar stands for Preschool Science Talk in Action and Reflection. In PreStar project, we wanted to empower teachers to be able to incorporate science-related conversations in their own classroom. One of the key goals that we have in this project is that we wanted teachers to be able to reflect deeply on their observations of children's interactions with science-related materials. And also, we want them to reflect on their own interactions and practices in the classroom. In Lincoln, we have three Head Start programs that we are working with, and also one of the classrooms in a community child care program. This study is occurring in Brazil as well. So we have two classrooms that are located in public preschool program, and two in private preschool program in Brazil. A escola pública EMEI Inácio Romero, que é uma escola que já vem é, trabalhando dentro das perspectivas do currículo da cidade de São Paulo, que é um currículo bastante avançado, que tem a brincadeira, a curiosidade, a investigação como pontos de partida. A outra escola é a escola do bairro, da qual eu sou fundadora, sou diretora. We collected data simultaneously in Brazil and also in Lincoln. So we went through these reflection sessions and videotaping sessions simultaneously to just see whether their reflection is different from our teachers' reflection. In primeiro lugar, os primeiros dados analisados da nossa investigação mostram que uma das dos pontos mais importantes no impacto das professoras é uh, a existência de materiais. E o outro é a relação com a universidade, ou seja, com uma praxis ou uma teoria que ilumina a prática. We found some similarities and differences between the two cultures and two um, countries. Teachers were using more and more science-related questions in their interactions with children as professional development and the reflection session went on and also they added some evaluation and future plans in their discussions of what could be done in the future to make improvements in their own practices. When I heard the proposal that could be with the science of nature, related to this work, I was very encouraged. And this was a moment sabe de disparar né assim um desejo muito grande de participar isso foi um grande incentivo eu acho que isso tinha que ser passado para todas as escolas porque assim você estu você se dedica para ensinar linguagem matemática e no entanto as ciências elas ficam meio que de lado né e aí eu acho que assim esse incentivo que foi essa pesquisa de ciências para a gente ela foi muito importante e ela tem que ser compartilhada eu acho que com mais pessoas so one of the key benefits that I learned from this project is that when you work with data from two different countries and two different cultures um, you need to find a way to have a better understanding of the context. So, for example, in Brazil, when they say a lack of materials, it might be really that lack of materials in the classroom and the lack of resources and professional development available in that context. However, in Lincoln, lack of materials may mean that the teacher didn't think about all the materials available in the classroom as a medium to talk about science. So as a future step, we are thinking of developing teacher training materials in different ways. So in the United States, in Nebraska, it may be a good idea to disseminate what we found to a research community as well as practitioner community. But in Brazil, I think it is more important to develop some kind of teacher education program and workshop materials and resources so that teachers can take it and use it in their classroom.